Hello guys, I'm here with the Chris, the one and only. It is 10.56 p.m. This is iPhone 6 pre-order night, so I'm going to be, well, hopefully pre-ordering it. Apple.com is currently completely down. The only part of Apple.com that's still up right now is store.apple.com, which is good, but if I can't get to the iPhone 6S pre-order page, I can't pre-order the phone. So, yeah, what we're going to be doing is we're just going to be kind of, ah, I'm ready for an all-nighter, I don't care, I want this damn phone, so we're just going to stay up and wait for it to come back. I think it might come back uh, before midnight, but who knows at this point. Anyway, yeah, we're just kind of chilling. I want to do a little update on my phone situation for now until I do get the 6S. As you can see, I, current, I have two iPhone 4S's now. This is an 8 gig Sprint model that I got uh, a few days ago. I didn't really make a video on it at the time. I got this for a whopping $5 from a friend, so that's pretty cool. It has a bad ESN also, so it's kind of a useless phone, but it was 5 bucks for a working iPhone, so that is definitely cool. It is running the Golden Master of iOS 9, so yeah, this is just going to be kind of my testing phone. It's kind of thrown together. All of the parts on this phone are not original to the phone itself, um, which was like, which, you know, my friend told me. So that, that would be Hunter Yelton on YouTube in case y'all want to look him up. He'll, he might comment on this. So yeah, there you go. So that's that. Um, and then I got this 16 gig AT&T iPhone 4S here, which, uh, if you notice is running iOS 6, but it wasn't before. I will explain that right about now. Anyway, I got this today and it had had iOS 7.1.2 on it. And so thanks to the help of Colin, AKA DOS Dude One, we were able to downgrade it to iOS 6.1.3, which runs so much better on this phone. And also, you know, it kind of gives me the feels because I had a four with iOS 6 back in the day, which was also white. So that's kind of cool. Anyway, yeah, this is my phone for until I get the 6S. Um, what happened with this phone when I got it was the dock connector was actually kind of iffy. Um, basically what was happening was it was it, it thought it was plugged into like a dock sound device and so the sound was completely non-functional and you know that was a bad dock connector so what I did was just swap the parts between the phone. So now this one is the one with the bad dock connector. You can see if I do the volume um, it, see it's completely gone and uh, if you lock it there's no sound so cleaning the connector will help for about five minutes but then it'll just go back to um, not working again but I don't care this is kinda just a throw around phone anyway this is the one I actually need to work so yeah like I said AT&T 16 gig 4S running iOS 6.1.3 runs really well glad I was able to do the downgrade it has down. It has already downloaded freaking 8.4.1, but I'm not gonna do that. I might jailbreak it and then use a software update killer. But yeah. Anyway, I have just a few apps on it right now: Facebook Messenger, Instagram. All those are older versions that still work with iOS 6, so that's cool. Anyway, that is that. So there you go. Still waiting on the iPhone 6s, so we'll keep you updated. Great news. Apple.com is back up. They were just going down for maintenance or something, so this is going live. Hi. The hype train is real. The doors have been opened. We have about 37 minutes left until, well, no, 38 since it's 12.01 a.m., but, yeah, so. Chris took some swaggy pics of my iPhones, so hopefully those are going to come out sweet. Anyway, yeah, I never really sound like it, but I'm really, really freaking excited for this. So, yeah, not too much longer now. Alright, we now have 22 minutes left on the clock. It's almost ready. The Apple site, like I said, is back up. I have Manly and Alan, a.k.a. Eaton Sniper Guy, on Skype here. So they're joining us for this wonderful event that is going on in the middle of the freaking night. Chris is editing photos over there, so that's that. Yeah, we're still waiting. Almost there. Okay. Locked in my iPhone there. Couldn't actually pay for it right now, but that's okay, I suppose. So, got it locked in. I had to make a store, an in-store reservation on the we on the pre-order website. So, yeah, I kind of have to be there at 1 p.m. so I can go ahead and get it. 
So, that, yeah. Uh, screenshot on the personal Facebook. Yeah, I know. Um, so, yeah, I have the phone locked in, so I will be getting one on launch day. So, that's that.